What's up and good morning guys. So I was actually out yesterday and I was picking up a winch plate. Uh, this guy sold this to me for 10 bucks, which was awesome. So I got this mounted on here. Just need to finish buttoning that up. I think what I want to do is do like the poison spider stinger. Uh, I found one. I want to put it on. I'm going for more of like a rock crawler um, slash clean look for this. So um, like I said, I'm going to do the poison spider stinger. I'd really like to find some simulate stimulated simulated beadlock steel wheels for this i have these right there as a backup or i'm also thinking about doing the jl wheels on here because 17 inch tires are just so much easier to find but again i think i really like that simulated uh steel wheel look so i'm trying to find a set of those i've missed out on a couple so far which sucks got the rear tire rack on so that's good to go but when i was picking up that uh winch plate yesterday the guy was like hey man do you want to buy a hard top? And I was like, yeah, usually those go for way more than what I can afford right now because I need to get some wheels and tires. But I went ahead and picked it up because he sold it to me for a great price. I'm going to insert a picture of here of how I got it home. So if you saw me run around Denver yesterday, uh, that's kind of what I did. So I was in the JL and uh, obviously I had no way to get it. So I tossed it on the roof flat and uh, drove it home. Worked out, got it home, and uh, pretty excited about it. So today I'm gonna go ahead and take this soft top off and uh, put it on there. This one has some rips. So I was trying to figure out what I wanted to do anyways, as far as replacing the windows and stuff. Um, but yeah, this solved the problem. It does have a plexiglass rear window, so I'll have to find a new rear window. But other than that, good to go. So I'm pretty pumped to, about scoring that and uh, let's get it tossed on. Now I will say this, I do really like the look of the soft tops on these, but I think quiet wise and sound wise and just stuff like that, I, I'm going to go ahead and just remove this, uh, get rid of it and go from there. I also want to get rid of these fenders. I'm trying to decide what route I want to go, whether I just delete them and run a steel front fender or kind of run it back as well. But again, that's just kind of the look I'm going for, and uh, we'll see how it works out. But uh, yeah, first thing first, let's take this off. I've never taken one of these off. It should be super easy, though. Well, that was super easy. So there you go. I like that I already have the hard doors, too, which is perfect for this. Um, it does look like I'm going to have to take that little piece off. But other than that, I'm kind of almost embarrassed to say this, too, that this is the first time I think I've had full top off a Jeep. So... Anyways, looks cool. Let's go ahead and slide this sucker on and uh, take a look from there. And there you go, got it on. I think it's cool, looks a lot better. Can't wait to drive around with it, that's for sure. Like I said, I'll figure out something for the rear glass later on, but for now, this has been working just fine. So I'll run with that. And um, nice, I love a good hard top. So all I'm gonna do is just get a sunshade, keep it under here, and then uh, when I wanna take the top off, I'll have the sunshade on there. Call it good. Go ahead and sell all this stuff. Minus that, I'll use that again. Anyways, nice. Thanks for watching. Tell me what you guys think. Hope it looks a lot better. I think it does. And then we'll keep dialing this in. Check this guy out. He used his bed for a trailer and then made his own bed. Interesting. All right, guys. Busy, hot day today. Let me show you what I accomplished real quick. So, there she is now. So again, I gotta get the stinger for up front. I'm gonna grab that, change these wheels up to black, hopefully get some new mud trains, change out the fenders, got the hard top on. The only thing I don't like is it's a little round in the back. I just don't like that about TJ's. I prefer like the JK. Still looks good. All right, got the spare tire on the back, winch, or the rear bumper. Got the trash roof. I just have it, so I just tossed it on. Um, relocated the license plate here. Used this because it was actually for the uh, the license plate delete. Wired it in here with the tail lights, so that's all good to go. So now I have a light and a brake light, which is actually neat. And the rear is pretty much done. I'm not going to do anything else to the rear of the Jeep. I like this setup again. I'm probably going to take these off soon, and hopefully I can find some fenders, metal fenders, tube fenders, and go from there. Um, and kind of delete that. But next on the list is definitely tires and wheels. It's gonna change the look. The stinger bumper and then fenders and armor. So that's kind of where I'm at and just keep doing maintenance. 
Again, I that top was a huge score. I wasn't planning on buying one, but I'm really happy that I was able to pick it up. So that's the Jeep now. That's how she sits, and uh, I'm really excited with it. So tell me, guys, tell me what you guys think. It's only gonna get better. And uh, again, thanks. Get on the trail soon.